Hi folks, we've been talking a lot about Facebook Live lately and uh, one of the things that I recommend you do when you've done a Facebook Live broadcast is save the broadcast so you can reuse it elsewhere, um, like upload it for YouTube for instance. So how do you do that? Well if you've created your live broadcast on your phone it does prompt you at the end of the broadcast whether you want to save it and if you say yes it will save it to your camera roll and then it's just another video file that you would download like any other video that you created on your phone or upload to YouTube direct from your phone if you wish. But what if you either didn't have space to do that or it's an old recording that perhaps you forgot to um, or didn't realise it was sensible to save it or perhaps you've created your Facebook Live um, broadcast on your PC or your laptop where it doesn't prompt you to save it. What do you do then? Well, the answer is really simple and there's, there's quite a lot of complex explanations out there, but this is a really straightforward way to do it. So um, I'm going to switch now to my um, desktop screen and show you how to do it because you have to do it on the desktop or laptop in a browser rather than on the Facebook app. So here we are on my Facebook page, Photography for Busy Business People. Just click on Videos option, and that will show you all the videos you've got. But all you need to do is find the video that you want to download. Now I'm going to pick this one, which is a Tuesday tip from a while back. Now click on the video, and it will bring it up in its own little sort of pop-up screen. And what you're interested in is this bit on the right-hand side, those three dots. If you click on there, it brings up a menu, and you download the video. It asks you where it should go. Um, you'll see it's got this long complex stream of numbers uh, but I'm going to call it Tuesday tip one or whatever's relevant something meaningful really uh, you'll see down here it's an MPEG4 movie so it's an MP4 file that you should be used to dealing with if you um, save videos just save it and that's job done now, if you recorded your live um, broadcast on your personal page, it looks slightly different, but the principle's the same. If I just click over to my personal page, and again, if I, long, if I go here and to videos, and your videos, right, here's the Facebook Live one I did earlier. Now, rather than opening it in its own screen, because you don't get the download option then, you need to click on this little edit option here, the pencil. You get two download choices this time, high definition or standard definition. I always recommend you download the high definition version because that's going to be the best quality. So I hope you found that useful. Uh, if you want more tips, then hop on over to my Facebook page, Photography for Busy Business People, or if you're watching this on YouTube, subscribe to the channel.